Hi guys, it's Nicole again. Welcome back to my channel. This is my second video. I was thinking like, what can I do? What type of videos do I want to do? Things like that. And I was walking through my house and saw the Daphne hair straightening brush. I'd actually never heard of this before. And my mom kept on hassling me. What do I want for Christmas? Um, and in the end, I'm like, do you know what just surprised me? Because I have no idea what I want. And I went to sell it because I was like, do you know what? I have a GHD. I don't really need it. I don't think that I'm going to really use it. So I looked into it and the pricing of them was around $300. And I'm like, do you know what? For something that's so expensive, this is probably going to be okay. So I thought today that I'd do a quick review on it for you, just so you know if it's worth it, my personal opinion, things like that. Now I've just had a shower um, and my hair is a little bit damp, but I thought, you know, it should be fine. So I haven't opened it yet. So when you open it, this is what it looks like. Whoops. All wrapped up. Okay. So literally all that's in the box is some leaflets you can see and the actual brush. And it says it takes about 60 seconds to actually heat up. So I'm just going to plug it in. Actually it did take under a minute to heat up. It'll flash red when you turn it on and when it's, when it's ready the green light will come up. So pretty much, I mean, every time I guess when you turn on something new that heats up, it has a weird, quite strange burning smell and this is the same, it smells like it's burning a bit. But from what I have gathered, you literally just brush your hair like normal. As I was saying, the instructions I guess to just brush your hair like normal. It's quite hot, so even the back is, um, I'm surprised because that's very hot to touch. I kind of didn't expect that. And just brush it through. I mean, just looking in the viewfinder, maybe I'll separate the sections a bit more. As I said, my hair is still a little bit damp, so... I don't know if that makes much of a difference. But, um, yeah, just brushing it through. It feels nice, like it does. Ah, uh, it does make your hair extremely hot. I might try underneath way. So as you can see, it does straighten. So it does work. See, compared to this side hasn't been done and this side. It definitely works. If your hair is a little bit damp though, it really doesn't work as well because I mean the front of my hair is very dry, but the back I can tell it's just not working as well. And it seems the slower you drag it through your hair the better or if you go underneath like that it seems to work quite well I have to say it's it's actually not as bad as I thought I think um it takes some use uh, getting used to just because like you go to brush your hair like normal and it's like you kind of bang your head a bit and it is quite like it's solid and um, the brush it, 
isn't too bad it's just yeah as I said it's very solid particularly when you're like when you hit your head I have to say looking at I don't have a mirror in front of me but just looking at the pictures in the viewfinder it does seem to make your hair quite shiny as well which is nice um but yeah whoops I don't know what happened just then but overall I mean is it easier than brushing your hair than using a straightener honestly I think it's just gonna be personal preference whatever you prefer um, it has pulled out a bit of hair as you can see there I don't know if it's focusing but I mean I guess that's to be expected with any brush but yeah it makes your hair feel good price wise I think it is quite expensive this one was from the shaver shop which I said again around the $300 mark which you know is quite expensive compared to a GHD which you can curl as well but I mean overall if you're more into straightening your hair then I guess yeah I probably I would recommend it it's not perfectly straight but compared to what it was I think it looks quite good Thanks so much for watching guys, if there's any other reviews in particular that you would like, just let me know, but thanks so much, bye!